The Corrales Bike and Wine Tour is exactly what it sounds like. You ride your bike and you sample wine made by local wineries along the way. And did you know New Mexico is the oldest wine producing region in the whole United States? And the village of Corrales is among some of the best grape growers in the area. Here's a preview of the four wineries that will be pouring on the Bike and Wine Tour. Welcome to Matheson Winery. Uh, we are a uh, small winery located in Rio Rancho, New Mexico. And uh, we uh, do 100% uh, New Mexican wines with 100% New Mexican grapes. We have a lot of fun and, uh, and it's, uh, it's a good time. So uh, come, come and see us. We have regular tasting room hours, uh, Wednesday through Sunday noon to five, and we'd love to see you here. Welcome to Corrales Winery. Uh, we've been a winery since 1999. We make a variety of different wines, uh, all of which are 100% New Mexico wines. Come on in and see us. We have a great location. We have a beautiful view of the mountains. Uh, all the tasting is complimentary and the wines are terrific. We're Pasando Tiempo Winery. We have very good wine, very nice. We have dries, we have some sweet wines, we have some semi-sweet wines. Uh, we love everybody to come out and visit uh, our, our property here. Uh, we give tours of the winery and the vineyard uh, for people that come out and hopefully they'll have a nice good time. We have beautiful views of the mountains and, and uh, just a lovely area to, to enjoy an afternoon. This is a Sequia Vineyards and Winery uh, in Corrales, New Mexico. The tasting room, if it wasn't going to be a Sequia Vineyards and Winery, it was going to be Alan Mel's Adobe Garage, because that's what it is. It's a beautiful, nice, quiet, homespun kind of tasting room. Um, we enjoy having small groups or larger groups in here. It's, it's more of an intimate uh, meet the winemaker and his wife type of atmosphere, since the entire company is the winemaker and his wife. Um, so it, it's, it's more like a real cozy one-on-one -on -one atmosphere. It looks like so much fun. And event planner Dana Kohler joins us now with more details about the tour that's coming up on Saturday, April 20th. Hi, Dana. Hello. How are you? Welcome back to the show. Thank you. You and I have been talking about this for quite a while now. I'm getting really excited. Tell everybody about the ride. Oh, it's a phenomenal ride. I mean, as you know, Corrales is one of our most beautiful areas mm -hmm. in New Mexico. You know, you have the wonderful Sandia Mountains as the backdrop, you know, the old San Ysidro Church, yeah. and then, of course, four of our finest wineries in New Mexico. Can't beat that. Uh, so it's a blast. I mean, we had, uh, in back in last August, we did it, and we had a, about 125 riders, and everybody left with the biggest smile on their Aww. face that they could have. So. That's so cool. Yeah, and then uh, as you do the ride, uh, you're welcome to buy, purchase bottles of wine. And so uh, you don't have to ride with those bottles. Though. We go around and we'll <laughs> pick good. them up good for advice, you. Good advice, good advice. And then we drop them off at the end of the event. So uh, what's nice about that is you have a souvenir. So people go back, uh, they can share something with their family and, and talk about yeah. you know, the Corrales Bike and Wine Tour. What a great event. Okay. Okay. If you're going wineries. on a bike ride, is this something more for road bikes or mountain bikes or both? I would definitely, uh, you know, all-terrain bikes is going to be best. Okay. All-terrain bikes, because, you know, we live in the desert, and, right. you know, if you want to avoid the uh, tires popping and things like that. Yeah, the then goat heads around here are horrible if you ride bikes. Yeah, yeah. exactly. So well, all-terrain bikes for sure. But uh, no suit and tie. No so, suit and tie. Very, very, very casual. Yeah. So. Well, I'm going to ask you what I asked you. First question I asked you when I called you on the phone that I know our viewers want to know. What if we don't have a bike that we own? Can we actually rent one? Are there local bike shops? How does it work? Yeah, there's actually a bike shop right outside of Corrales. Uh, it's okay. Hawks tricycle and they will be able to provide Can I ride some a tricycle too? <laughs> yeah <laughs> they have like all kinds of different bikes there it's you great do, yeah, one of the re-bikes where you sit back right, I like those. Bikes. you could do that <laughs> yeah. I feel very comfortable in those oh, okay <laughs> so, yeah there's absolutely places to rent and you That's can contact us uh you know and we'll help you know contact me personally I'll help you okay. find something okay but we'll there's have that definitely um yeah, Steve's uh, bikes in Corrales, they rent too. Perfect. So. Okay, is it just wine or are there restaurants involved too? Can you get a bite to eat as you're going on the tour as well? Luckily this year there will be. Oh, good. Um, we are, um, Joe's Pasta House is joining the event oh, we this love year. Them. So uh, you'll be able to do your ride to the four wineries. After the event, you'll go back to Bliss Salon where it started. Bliss Salon is going to be there to like freshen people up and oh. make them feel comfortable after this hard wine and you know, wine ride. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, and then at the end, uh, Joe's Pasta House will be serving some like hors d'oeuvres and finger food Good. while you're listening to some jazz music by a band called Good Green. Oh, this is an amazing cool. event. Yeah. Right, real all quick, around. how long is the ride total? The, it's only about, it's between like eight and nine miles. So oh, it's not so very not bad at all. Anybody yeah. can do that. It's you don't have to be relaxing. a great biker to do that. Right. Yeah, and exactly. you can see on the screen all the details. Dana, remind everybody how they can get involved. Yeah, uh, you can visit our website at CorralisBikeAndWineTour.com. Great. My information's on there. Feel free to call me personally. 
and we'll make sure you're taken care of. Perfect. I want to be there. It sounds incredible. Yeah. Thank you so much. Oh, thank you. It's going to be a good time. Well, we'll see you there. Okay.